What's going on YouTube? I am back with another video and in this one we have a really exciting PSA economy submission reveal. So uh, I'm, I wanna say right off the bat that none of these cards are mine and this is actually not even a group submission. So these cards were all sent by one local customer. Uh, it's a 36 card order. Typically, if I'm gonna send an order by itself for someone, I usually like to have around 50 cards, whether it be PSA or SGC. Uh, but if you do if you do wanna send your cards in a separate order from everyone else, uh, you can definitely do that. And um, if you don't quite have 50, you can also pay for shipping to and from, again, whether it be PSA or SGC. So that is what I did in this case. So that is, uh, again, this is, these cards are all from one local customer. And uh, I, I won't always show the results on the channel, but this customer in particular had some really, really nice cards. So I definitely want to show them off on the channel. Uh, so again, none of these are mine. Uh, if you guys follow me on Instagram, you know I post a lot of reels showing off some of the submission highlights. I always put in all caps, these cards are not mine and it never fails. I get multiple DMs asking how much certain cards are. So I just wanna make it very, very clear. These cards are not mine uh, because I know I would get a lot of people you know, interested in some of these really nice cards. So uh, moving on, I do just wanna mention real quick the, uh, the time frame for this submission. Uh, again, this was sent at Economy. That is the $50 level. If you guys are interested in joining any of my submissions, check out 502frank.com. All the information is there. Uh, but this submission in particular was entered in the PSA system on April 7th and was shipped back on May 12th. That is a total of 25 business days. So uh, very, very fast. It's slowing down maybe just a little bit from some of my uh, recent ones that I've shown on the channel, but still very, very fast for $50 price point. So uh, doing really good there. And now I do wanna go ahead and pause. I'm not sure if we have two giveaways to do. I know for sure we have one from the one-on-one -on -one basketball challenge. If you missed that last video, make sure to check that out. I thought that was a pretty entertaining video. Uh, didn't get a you know ton of views or anything, but uh, if you missed that one, check it out. Uh, so we're gonna do that giveaway, and I think we might have one other one. Uh, so we're gonna throw those up now, and then I'll be right back, and we will get into this reveal. All right guys, so now that the giveaway is out of the way, we are ready to go ahead and get into this submission reveal. So I did kind of sort through these a little bit. I'm gonna start with some of the bigger cards in the submission uh, because I did go ahead and put together a little Instagram reel of some of the highlights. So you guys are gonna see some of the, the bigger cards uh, first. So I'm sure as you guys saw from the title and thumbnail, this submission did include a one of one Ronaldo, which is crazy. So this one came out of Leaf Vibrance. And if you guys are not familiar with, with Leaf Vibrance, I kind of, I thought about opening some on the channel because there's been some local people open some boxes at Lowell Sports Cards and they are all like solid. I haven't seen really any just horrible boxes. Um, you know, every single box I've seen has at least like, I don't know, maybe like half your value back. Uh, everything is super low numbered. There's big names in there like Giannis, uh, you know, as you can see, Ronaldo. So thought about opening some of that on the channel, but just, just haven't yet. Um, so maybe in the future, uh, but we have a gold vinyl, one of, one of one Ronaldo auto, and it did get the PSA 10, which is just an added bonus. So very, very cool card there. One of one Ronaldo. And then we do have a Justin Herbert Mosaic Rookie Scripts, actually a card that I have previously owned. Uh, 2020 Panini Mosaic was really, really good to me. Uh, pulled that Lamar Genesis, you can't really see it, but I pulled that, pulled the Burrow Auto, Herbert Auto, so just crazy, crazy. Um, 2020 Mosaic was so good. Uh, and then we do have another Herbert. This one is the Phoenix Teal, PSA 10. Really nice one here, Mac Jones out of Mosaic Choice, the red yellow. This one's gonna be numbered to 80, and that one did get a 10 on the Mac Jones. So a big card there. We got a Shohei uh, Tops Heritage Chrome Purple Refractor 10. And how about a Peacock? So another one out of Mosaic Choice, Travis Etienne Peacock PSA 10. Uh, Joe Burrow Optic Hollow PSA 10. And Jonathan Kuminga, Donruss Choice Auto. You can barely see it. Honestly, when I first looked at this, I didn't even realize it was an auto. You can just barely see that JK there kind of, you know, on his shoes. Uh, but that one did get a 10 as well. Kind of matches the Franz Wagner, if you guys can see that guy back there. Um, anyway, we have next card, Tyrese Maxey. His stuff was really, really hot. He played well in the playoffs for sure. So PSA 10 on the Maroon die cut. That's 
definitely a nice grade. Die cuts are always tough. Uh, Davis Mills Honeycomb, one of my absolute favorite parallels. I uh, love the Honeycomb parallel. Just really, really pops on the card. Tyrese Maxi Select Rookie Signatures. That one did get a nine. So there are some eights and nines in this uh, submission, but as you can see from the start, overall, very, very good results. Uh, Michael Jordan Net Assets. That one's, uh, you know, kind of like that acetate card. It's gonna always be a tough one. That one got a seven. Um, and then next up, we have a Bowen Byram autograph, one that I am not familiar with, but that one got an, uh, a nine. Not a name I'm familiar with. Don't do a lot of hockey, which I'm sure you guys know. Uh, Jordan Love select uh, field level silver 10. LeBron James hoops artist proof. That one got a nine. That one's gonna be out of uh, 25, I believe that says. Got a Jordan finest. That one got an eight. Then we have a Devers Topps Chrome Auto. That one also got an eight. So a bit of a tough one there. Jordan Love Mosaic Auto. That one got a nine. Uh, back to tens. We got a Shohei Bowman's Best Refractor 10. Steph Curry Rookie 10. So uh, there's definitely still some solid results throughout. Didn't, you know, just throw all the bangers up front. Most of them, but not all. Uh, Blaze Jordan Bowman Refractor Auto 9. That one's going to be out of 499. And our next stack here, we have a Kobe out of hoops. That one's going to be 299. The green, that one uh, did also get a 10. Really nice patch here. This one is 2003 Ultimate Tom Brady Game uh yeah game jersey patch that one did get an eight but honestly on a card like this who really cares with you know such a uh sick patch number to 175 very very nice looking card uh big fan of that one and we got a trevor lawrence absolute rpa with some really nice patches that one's gonna be the 99 and that one did get an eight absolute you know thicker rpas those are always gonna be tough so eight on that one and then next up, we do have a Kobe Bryant jersey card. And that one got a 10. So that one's also a little bit of a thicker one. So definitely a nice grade on that, on a Kobe. Uh, LeBron Mamba's Choice. This one got an 8. Again, tough grades on the die cuts. Uh, we have another LeBron. This is a Prism Superstars Silver. And that one did get a 10. LeBron Prism Ruby Wave. That one got an 8. So another, you know, bit of a bit of a tougher one on a modern card. Uh, Kuminga, hoops, rookie ink. That one got a nine. And coming down to the last few here, we have a Burrow Prism, red, white, and blue. That one got a nine. Nice one here. Tom Brady from 2012 out of Prism got a ten. Joe Burrow, pink camo. That one got a nine. We have a Michael Jordan finest refractor nine. Very nice looking card there. Back to Shohei, we got a Bowman Chrome 10 from 2018. And then we have a Shohei uh, Prism Refractor, PSA 10. And our final card of the submission, we are gonna finish with a nine. So we have another Shohei out of Topps Chrome. That one is a Refractor and that one did get a nine. Uh, so overall solid results, uh, you know, you guys saw a couple sevens eights nines but the the first like five or six cards that we started off in the submission were just incredible so hopefully you guys did enjoy getting to see these really nice cards again none of these were mine if you skip forward a little bit these cards are not mine these were uh, sent by a local customer so i will be dropping these off at louisville sports cards here in a little bit if you guys are interested in joining an sgc or psa submission again all information is on 502frank.com Hopefully you guys enjoyed this one. I will have a lot more PSA and SGC submissions coming in the next few days. So definitely be on the lookout for more of these type of videos. Um, again, hopefully you enjoyed. I'll see you soon.